What's up? It's me, Mr. B, and we about to get crazy. With a sniffle. Alright. So, we're about to say goodbye to old Freddy. And hello to the news. So, we're going to play a Freddy match. And, um, within this gameplay, we're going to show you how you could do well with Freddy. There, there's a lot of pallets on this match. Well, this is a, a gameplay for the Freddies out there. And sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do to, like, still exploit infinite loops. You definitely wanna do what you can to get them out of the game. But we did pretty well in this match. We we got a decent um, score, almost a perfect game, but not quite. At the end, people just you know. But what made Freddy kind of okay is his uh, stopping the gen rush, and um, pretty much. I don't know. I thought he was okay. I I think he could have used the buff. The thing I would have done b instead of reworking him is upgraded his power a little bit to five seconds sleep some people say four I, I say five and then adjust the you know the things about five seconds sleep and um also you could have um made so self-care can't wake you up and he would have been pretty balanced <laughs> he would have been okay he wouldn't have been a great killer i think this new update is going to be all right though but um i think people <laughs> are overestimating the uh pallets pallet power he must dude I'm, I'm potato i saw where he went this time i don't know how he landed there though that's weird but i don't think the pallets are going to be so good when the survivors start knowing how to play against freddy like they're going to be watching when they're awake they're going to be looking for um pallets uh, that are safe and you're not going to get as much benefit once you get in high ranks versus Freddy I don't think with the pallets. The snares on the other hand I think they might do a little better. I'm the only one probably but um you gotta put a whole new uh, add-on on to make it so his um powers um not as good. You gotta put but you could add multiple different uh, add-ons on and just keep the snares and if you put two snares by one pallet you probably you're definitely gonna get a free hit unless they upgrade the snares they were pretty underwhelming I should have swung there he would just drop the pallet quicker though so what I did there was um, I baited him to go oh uh, the way I wanted him to go and he still went to a safe pallet Alright, so this guy's a little cocksucker, and he needs to die. He's a lot of pallets, but very little above. Yeah, he did drop a lot of pallets, though, and there's three gens left, so... I got a little bit of time to turn this game around. With Pop Goes the Weasel, and um, we're gonna try to do that. Yeah, that one person staying injured, that's not the play against Freddy because you're going to go down. It's like almost a free hit. That was a very bad play. If my sleep was a little better, if I could put him to sleep a little faster, I could have uh, double punished this because I really want him now. Because that was a bad play and they need to be punished for it. I didn't know he was still asleep. I, sh I would have just swung if I did. <laughs> he fucked up. <laughs> I fucked up too though, so.
We're getting pretty lucky. <laughs> Alright, he broke out, so we gotta put him back to sleep. Then we're gonna go pull him off. I tried something cheeky, and it almost worked. That, that had a low probability of working, but I knew he's going to just drop anyways. So I try to get the head start. He needs to die. Then our infectious fright comes into play. She's injured too. I love infectious fright. She's already asleep. Auto aim, fuck me. Now we have some pretty good momentum. Every single person is injured. We probably could have ended this game right here, but we didn't. Because we have some really high momentum right now, and we want to take advantage of it. We do want that guy dead, though. He's our main threat. Because he's a fucking punk. He keeps using that balance landing, and it's really pissing me off. He just wants to try to infinite loot me. He's not very good at it though. I've seen him better. He ran right into me. Thank you. I really want him dead too. Dude. Yeah, I'm I'm killing him. I really want him dead. I don't care how many generators they get done, but he needs to die. I'm killing him all. I can't stand this fucking piece of shit. Then the lag wouldn't let me hop through that window very quickly. I'm, I'm really agitated with this guy. But it's okay because we got a kill. This game's over. This game is over once you get one person dead with Freddy. Old Freddy. There isn't much you can do. There's very little you can do versus him. Now most people would just go after the Nia in this situation. I'm not most people. So I try to go after the Gen Rush. And it was the right play. This guy's already injured. That person's not. This person wants a body block. I realize that. And I uh, try to get him to where he's back in this uh, T wall. Or L wall. Is that L wall? It's L wall. L wall, T wall. Now I would have just um, did the red glow mind game where you go around that corner where he's standing right now, you show your glow, and then you just back up, but I kind of had it figured I could hit him, so it don't matter. Now I know where the last two's at, so I'm going to try to go over there. Since I popped this. Alright. Yeah, it's really hard to beat Freddy uh, at this stage. When there's three people, you're going to see what you can do with him. He's like, he knows where you're at. Yeah. Now this is where they fucked up. Really bad. This was a bad play. And she made it even worse by going to her uninjured teammate. Uh, yeah, I'm talking like I'm them, like I know what they're thinking, which I do. No, she's going to use that speed boost to unhook her friend. Everybody's injured. Infectious Sprite is going to do the rest of the work for me, and I know this. I know where everybody's at, too, which doesn't really help their cause. Dude, there's, like, how? That's what I want to know. How on earth did he get through me when... Uh, I'm not 
I'm invisible. Uh, when you're in Dream World, you can't just walk through me. He already used Dead Hard. You can't say that. I don't know how, what he did. But it doesn't matter. Now, see, that's the power of Freddy. Uh, you don't have that power now. You kind of do with the Infectious Sprite if you add it to your arsenal, but... That's a strong power. Once, there, once one person's dead, you win. Have a lot better than my doctor gameplay I just did. My doctor got his ass handed to him. Look at that. You're gonna see that a lot if you use a Freddy main. I uh, I misplayed there. I should have picked White up, but I didn't think he had unbreakable and I don't know if she does and I kind of figured I could get her anyways even with the D strike if not she'd unhook her friend and then I'd get her later or try to pick up Dwight I knock him down knock her down put him sleep knock him down before he gets the unhook you know either way I pretty much won this game and I know it but pretty he, he might not be the strongest killer, but he, he's way more viable than what people gave him credit for. Like I said earlier, if they just drop a sleep tower, sleep power to five seconds and made it so self-care couldn't wake you up, he has been pretty good. But they did a whole new rework, which is like having a new killer, which is nice. The blood, the blood puddles, I think, are going to be better eventually, maybe, if they buff them. I don't know. Um, I think there's gonna be counter to the pallets and the blood. Really, it's just pick your poison. Should have got wrecked sooner. Almost a perfect. Damn, we had a level 3 in the lobby already? How are you that high? You play this game all the time. <laughs>